Jeff Koons was born in 1955 in York, Pennsylvania. He grew up in a working-class family and initially pursued a career in finance before turning to art. Koons is known for his vibrant, larger-than-life sculptures that often depict everyday objects, such as balloon animals and toys. His work blurs the lines between high art and popular culture, challenging the traditional notions of beauty and taste. Kuhn's work has often sparked controversy, with some critics dismissing it as shallow and lacking in artistic merit. Others praise his ability to create works that are simultaneously playful and profound. One of Kuhn's most famous works is Balloon Dog, a stainless steel sculpture of a balloon animal that sold for a record-breaking $58.4 million at auction in 2013. Peace has become an icon of contemporary art and a symbol of Kuhn's career. One of Kuhn's most famous works is Puppy, a towering sculpture of a West Highland Terrier made from flowers. The sculpture was first displayed in Germany in 1992 and has since been shown in cities all over the world, becoming a beloved icon of contemporary art. Another iconic work of Kuhn's is his series of balloon dogs, which are stainless steel sculptures modeled after the classic children's party balloon animal. The sculptures come in a range of colors and have sold for tens of millions of dollars at auction. Kuhn's work has also been the subject of controversy, with some critics accusing him of being a sellout who creates art solely for the purpose of making money. Others have criticized his use of kitsch and popular culture imagery in his works. Regardless of the controversy surrounding his work, there's no denying the impact that Jeff Koons has had on the contemporary art world. Kuhn's influence on contemporary art is undeniable, with his work inspiring a new generation of artists and collectors. His ability to create works that are both visually stunning and conceptually complex has made him one of the most important artists of our time. Despite his success, Kuhn's has faced criticism for his commercialism and willingness to create works that cater to the tastes of the wealthy elite. Some argue that his work perpetuates a culture of consumerism and excess. Koons has also been involved in philanthropy and charity work, including the creation of a series of sculptures to benefit the International Center for Missing and Exploited Children. And there you have it, a brief overview of the life, work, and legacy of Jeff Koons. Love him or hate him, there's no denying his impact on contemporary art.